I'm Greg Wells, I'm one of the sales managers at Raymarine and I'm going to show you some top tips today. Today's top tips will be how to calibrate your wind speed and depth connected to your Axiom display, Axiom Pro in this case, running Lighthouse 4. Very simple process, we go into settings, we go into network, we select the Raymarine ITC5 which is where your wind and speed are connected and you press calibrate. I then go into the wind and here you have all your options. It's telling you your current data and what you can do. First thing we should do is linearize the transducer. So I'm going to press the button now and then ask my skipper Roger to do the circle. Roger, yes. if you could do, carry on doing a circle please. Okay, Roger, calibration complete. Okay, so having linearized a transducer, the next thing we need to do is to align the wind transducer. And to do that, we need to get the skipper to now sail head to wind at about three to four knots. Roger, could you now steer head to wind? Okay, we're right in the middle yeah. of the <laughs> Okay, I understand when you've got space. And when you go head to wind, use the wind X as your gauge. Okay. As a... Remember that's an apparent wind. Yeah. That's why I want you to go directly into the wind. Five knots would be perfect. Four two five. Four two five. Oh. <laughs> and let me know when you're there. Okay, so we're now head to wind. I will align, and the transducer is updated. And that, and then you can then check your wind on each tack and you can apply a little bit of angle adjustment. If you think you need to put a few degrees in, either to port or to starboard, you can do that from this button here. Likewise, for the speed, sometimes you might think your wind is under reading or over reading, you can apply a scaling factor to adjust the apparent wind. As you can see, very simple process for calibrating your wind.